Hello there people, it's me again and now I am finally presenting you the drawing that I promised in yesterday's video where I'll draw mine and Jurassic Bob's characters infected with Venom Incarnate symbiotes. And I will not lie to you, this drawing was challenging to say the least. I, I could not figure out how to post them properly and I also was struggling with the idea of Julian, the one with the wings, giving him a hoodie, just like Gwenom has. But it, it just didn't work out well, and it kind of felt too busy around his head, because there was the hoodie, the teeth, the eye, like face in general, and then the wings right behind that, and then also there were some problems with my character where I was struggling to figure out how to draw his face and or how to pose him, especially him. And in the end, he is supposed to be a male, but the way I drew him is more feminine, which I don't really mind. If this could be like an alternate version where he is a female which I'm fine with. Even then, later on, you can see that I added these, like, lashes to, well, her, and, um, that, I, <laughs> at that point, I was just still telling myself, if it's a female, why not roll with it properly, G give him the lashes, a little reference to Evelyn from League of Legends. <laughs> and, um, yeah, that, that's really it when it comes to the character design. Th this one had me really outside of my comfort zone because I wanted to do something different with them but stay like true to their characters as well. Where you you could recognize it, it's kind of them but uh, with the Venom and Carnage symbiotes. Which I'm not exactly sure if I achieved, like properly. You got, you at least got the color schemes kind of right. As, well, especially with the Julian, where I took uh, inspiration from one of my pictures of uh, him in the future, where it's more like uh, neon colors, but. Obviously, it's Venom, so it was black. And what I did is what they used to do in, or like what they do in uh, with Venom in the comics, where he is supposed to be all black, but they give him this like navy blue or like dark blue colors to differentiate um, like the muscles and details. And they even did it in the 90s Spider Man animated series, where half of his details are blue and the other half is red so I kind of stuck to the green And then with my character, I'm gonna call her she now. Uh, I kind of had like reference to Evelyn, as I said, and then also to his or like her mask, where it's like three slits, and I made that into like very elongated spikes slash eyes. And then I thought the character is left-handed. So let's give the right hand, like, let's not have it a proper right hand, but let's make it like into a hook or something. And then I added the usual carnage veins stuff, and yeah. Then I tried to add some details with pencils, because that's usually what I do. I go over sharpies with pencils just to add some more detail and depth into it, which I'm not really sure if that really worked on this particular drawing. I, I feel like it made it a little bit more dull. But 
but yeah, like I said, if I will eventually redraw these designs, yeah, it will be very different and I'll probably do it very differently as well. Yeah, that's it for today. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye.